everybody. We're about to get things underway here. We're going to be playing some Porter 2, continuing with our campaign. Now, I don't know if we're going to finish the campaign or not this episode or this stream. Um, we very well might have no idea. But, you know, if we do, you know, we might, you know, be interested in, you know, trying to play some cooperative um, or some multiplayer. Um, but, you know, I have honestly no, have no idea if anyone ever plays this game <laughs> anymore, so that might be quite difficult. I'm sure there is quite a few people that do play this game, but, you know, like, you know, whether or not someone actually plays multiplayer, you have no idea. That'll probably be very, very hard to get into. But we are just going to, you know, hop in things here. Hopefully things saved. <laughs> like if it does, I'm going to be so angry. But I believe this game auto saves itself. So hopefully we, we're going to be, you know, spawning the same spot that we did. But happy Tuesday to everyone. You know, hopefully you guys are having a good day. And we did spawn at the same location. So that's very, very nice. Um, let's go and continue with the campaign, shall we? So, this part is kind of boring, you know, not too much that, you know, you know, it, it's not the most entertaining thing in the world, um, throughout these puzzles, but, you know, they get a little bit more difficult as you go along here. Okay. We need to end up getting over there, maybe. But we're supposed to do this. And we gotta press this handle over here. Welcome Alrighty. To Road fuck. Why? Why would you do lost. that? And you are it. So, who's ready to make some science? I am. Okay, that's going to be uh, a little complicated, but so you know, I, I'm I understand it, so... I own the place. That eager voice you heard is the lovely Carolyn, my assistant. Rest assured, she has transferred your honorarium to the charitable organization of your choice. Isn't that right, Carolyn? Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. She's the backbone of this facility. Pretty as a postcard, too. Sorry, fellas. So we gotta She's go up here. to like jump off this thing to get speed where we can make that jump. And the store is going There's to open a for us. Performed every day here in our mission Pretty spheres. simple. I can't personally oversee every one of them, so these pre-recorded messages will cover any questions you might have and respond to any incidents that may occur in the course of your science adventure. Your test assignment will vary depending on the well, manner in which you have bent the world the to your will. There. Those of you helping us test the repulsion gel today, just follow the blue line on the floor. Yeah, Those of you who volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, I've got some good news and some bad news. Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. Good news is we've got a much better test for you. Fighting an army of mantis men. Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. I want to do that. I, I'll volunteer for that. <laughs> good God. Okay. So, let's go ahead and... This here, and I go way down here. I'm gonna pull it right here. And this is how we get to the other side. Really made that of a <laughs> okay. Where is our first pumping station? Mario. 
open, duh. Why wouldn't it be? say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No hand-holding. Interesting. I'm going to start trying to explain more what I do in streams and whatnot because I get it can be... Kind of confusing. Hello. All right, let's get started. That's this bright. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did wow. happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative, or so I'm told. Alrighty. So we gotta go up here somehow. just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded <laughs> messages. I pay the wow. bills I can talk about the control group all damn day. Yeah, so we don't want to go that way. It's not going to be a good idea. Okay, I see. Almost forgot about this. Where am I supposed to go here? You're making too much time. Okay, here we go. Oh, this is just an office. Never mind. Oh, the other way. <laughs> God, this is so fucking confusing. <laughs> what the hell is this shit? For this next test, we put nanoparticles oh, no, in the gel. Off. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. Do this here. Do this. Really? Are you serious right now? Do you fall off? No. Oh! 
<laughs> oh, God, in case you got this. covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, <laughs> but I'll tell you this, it's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. <laughs> Some of these jokes in this game are just All these science fears are made hilarious. of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping. Because that's not part of the test. How does asbestos keep our rats? Good news no is the sense. lab boys say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few rounds of canasta. Plus, you forwarded the cause of science by three centuries. I punch those numbers into my calculator and it makes a happy face. This is a little bit complicated, but... Could be confusing. Okay, this is confusing. Ah, here we go. I knew this was something. <laughs> I like your style. <laughs> You make up your own rules, just like me. Bean counter said I couldn't fire a man just for being in a wheelchair. Did it anyway. Ramps are expensive. <laughs> wow. Ramps are expensive. Ah, oh, excuse me, guys. Ah, oh, that sucked. I have no idea how to get up there, to be honest. Now I know. This wasn't working to begin with. Okay, I 
understand. It. Just a heads up, there that coffee we gave you earlier had fluorescent calcium in it so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. Alrighty. I am probably really, really quick at this than normal. <laughs> I already know what to do. Now, if you're part of control group Kepler-7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're going to need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. Uh... Thank you? <laughs> Seriously? right now. Get out there, yes! Made it. I'm telling them, keep your pants on. All right, this next test may involve trace amounts of time travel. So, word of advice, if you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Lab boys tell me that'll wipe out time, entirely forward and backward. So, do both of yourselves a favor and just let that handsome devil go about his business. Oh, shit. That was not supposed to happen. System. Yes, I did. <laughs> I just cheated the system. That was amazing. I don't think I was supposed to. So, you guys are probably wondering what the hell? How do you do this? Well, I'll show you. We gotta go back here, and this is for potion gel, with that post covered. Believe me, this took me so long to figure out. But I eventually did figure it out. Now what you gotta do is go flying. That's pretty much what you need to do. Alrighty. If you're hearing this, it means you're taking a long time on the catwalk between tests. The lab boys say that might be a fear reaction. I'm no psychiatrist, but coming from a bunch of eggheads who wouldn't recognize the thrill of danger if it walked up and snapped their little pink bras, that sounds like projection. They didn't fly into space, storm this. a beach, or bring back the gold. No, sir, we did. It's you and me against the world, son. I like your grip. Hustle could use some work, though. Now let's solve this thing. We're gonna try to catch this damn cube. Come here, man. Come here. Come here. No, don't pick up the glass, are you stupid? Ah! It would be so annoying sometimes. Got you! Fucking bitch, now you gotta go clean this cube off.
science isn't about why, it's about why not. Why is so much of our science dangerous? Why not marry safe science if you love it so much? In fact, why not invent a special safety door that won't hit you on the butt on the way out because you are fired? Now you test subject, you're doing fine. <laughs> yes, you. What? Box, what did I do? Parking lot, car, goodbye. Wow. So this is just so strange. Congratulations. The simple fact that you're standing here listening to me means you've made a glorious contribution to science. As founder and CEO of Aperture Science, I thank you for your participation and hope we can count on you for another round of tests. We're not gonna release this stuff into the wild until it's good and damn ready, so as long as you keep yourself in top physical form, there'll always be a limo waiting for you. Uh, Say goodbye, Carolyn. Goodbye, Carolyn. Oh. She is a gem. I think we need to go over here. Yes, we do. Here's one of the doors. This is interesting. Because you're gonna time this just right or it'd be stupid on you. So. No, this seems a little bit strange, but what you need to do. Pretty much go flying in time. That cube or, or that you know, portal box right there when you come through the blue portal. This is where you gotta make sure you get the right portal. See what I mean? <laughs> it's not easy. We go now we gotta go save Gladys little bitch because she is in she's right there in that freaking nest over there greetings friend I'm Cave Johnson CEO of Aperture Science you might know us as a vital participant in the 1968 Senate hearings on missing astronauts and you've most likely used one of the many products we invented but that other people have somehow managed to steal from us Black Mesa can eat my bankrupt- Sir, the testing? Right. Now you might be asking yourself, Cave, just how difficult are these tests? What was in that phone book of a contract I signed? Am I in danger? Let me answer yes, the question I made it. with a question. Who wants to make $60? Cash. <laughs> you can also feel free to relax for up to 20 minutes in the waiting room, which is a damn sight more comfortable than the park benches most of you were sleeping on when we found you. So, welcome to this conversation. You're here because we want the best, and you're it. Nope. Couldn't keep a straight face. Anyway, don't smudge up the glass down there. In fact, why don't you just go ahead and not touch anything unless it's test related. Oh, hi. Hello, Gladys. Hey, little you're bitch. Gladys. Could you ow, order this bird for me? Oh. Ow. Oh. Ow. Oh. No, wait. Just kill it and we'll call things even between us. No hard feelings. Please get it off me. Oh man, I wanna go ahead and It's eating me. I wanna go ahead and see if I'm actually alive right now or not, because I have no idea. I wanna make sure I'm not on was that set to private. Okay, I did it set to public. Okay, just wanted to make sure uh, we were good. Come on, get back in the game. I'm all tabbed out of it now. Okay. There we go. We are back in action here. Oh, thanks. Hello, bitch. Did you feel that? That idiot doesn't know what he's doing up there. This whole place is going to explode in a few hours if somebody doesn't disconnect him. I can't move. And unless you're planning to saw your own head off and wedge it 
injured into my old body. You're going to need me to replace him. We're at an impasse. So what do you say? You carry me up to him and put me back into my body, and I stop us from blowing up and let you go. Okay. No tricks. This potato only generates 1.1 volts of electricity. I literally do not have the energy to lie to you. Even if I am... Okay. <laughs> Do you have a multimeter? Never mind. The gun must be part magnesium. It feels like I'm outputting an extra half a volt. Keep an eye on me. I'm going to do some scheming. Here I go. Oh, where are we? How long have I been out? That extra half volt helps, but it isn't going to power miracles. If I think too hard, I'm going to fry this potato before we get a chance to burn up in the atomic fireball. That little idiot is going to... What the fuck am I doing with my life? There we go. Well, this is a little... That's great. You got a time right? There we go! I somehow was able to push myself over to the right a little bit. Or it was left, I'm sorry. I don't know what I did, but... No, the on. testing area is just up ahead. The quicker you get through, the quicker you'll get your 60 bucks. Oh, God. Oh. Carolyn, are the compensation vouchers ready? Yes, yes sir, sir, Mr. Johnson. Johnson. Why did I just... Who is that? What the hell is going on here? <laughs> yeah, let me do this real quick, please. This. forgot about this. Alrighty, so we gotta do this. do some magic shit. This will make a little bit more sense here. Just a little bit. Oh yeah, I got it. <laughs> okay. That was amazing. need to relax. We're still going to find out what the hell's going on here, but calmly. We gotta get over to that platform over here and there's only way you can do it.
missed it! Shit! <laughs> oh my god, I cannot believe I missed that! God damn it, that was horrible! God damn it, that was... Ugh. That was shitty. <laughs> I cannot believe I did that! Oh my god. Try that again! <laughs> God damn it. That was not supposed to happen. Why the stupid shit again? Try to get it straight this time. There we go! Finally! God damn it! <laughs> that was embarrassing! <laughs> Why did I do that? Listen up down there. That thing's called an elevator, not a bathroom. I swear I know him. <laughs> you do know him. If you're interested in an additional $60, flag down a test associate and let him know. You could walk out of here with 120 weighing down your bindle if you let us take you apart, put some science stuff in you, then put you back together. Oh, uh, no, th no, thank you. I'm not a robot. Maybe I am, but... <laughs> Gotta do that. Because regardless, you're going to need that later. All the way back here as much as we can. Oh, fuck, I forgot about this. Shit. There we go. Now we can do this. We gotta go get that cube on that platform. This is the first thing you have to do. Just drop down here. We don't need that platform anymore. Now we gotta make our way over here. Okay. Wait a minute, we gotta... Before we put this cube down, we gotta... We gotta go over here real quick. Because we gotta... Put like that blue crop down there. Now we can use the cube. That should be good enough for the rest. Gotta do more of this here. Oh. In case you're interested, there's still some positions available for that bonus opportunity I mentioned earlier. Again, I'm not getting paid for this. There's assembly. no point. We're not banging rocks like, together here. We know how to put a man back together. So that's a complete like really? assembly. New vitals, spit shine on the old ones. Plus, we're scooping out tumors. Frankly, you ought to be paying us. I'm not gonna pay you to do an operation on me. Are you freaking kidding me? Which I could possibly die? I mean... That is awful. 
wrong with you? Thank you. I can't believe I'm thanking these people. For well, staggering your you, way through temperature sciences propulsion gel testing, you've made some real contributions to society for a change, and for that, humanity is grateful. If you had any belongings, please pick them up now. We don't want old newspapers and sticks cluttering up the building. For many of you, I realize $60 is an unprecedented windfall, so don't go spending it all on, I don't know, Carolyn, what do these people buy? Tattered hats? Beard dirt? The parries will look up sometimes. There we go. Carolyn, 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 why do I know this woman? Did I kill her? Or. Oh my god. Look, Ooh. you're doing a great job. Can you handle things for yourself? For a I while? was thinking maybe those were going to drop down, but that doesn't have enough to turn these off first. You bet! Oh my god! God, that's really scary. Since making test participation mandatory for all employees, the quality of our test subjects has risen dramatically. Employee retention, however, has not. <coughs> As a result, you may have heard we're going to phase out human testing. There's still a few things left to wrap up, though. Now, the bean counters told me we literally could not afford to buy $7 worth of moon rocks, much less $70 million. Bought them anyway. Ground them up, mixed them into a gel. Guess what? Ground up moon rocks are pure poison. I am deathly ill. Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. So now, we're gonna see if jumping in and out of these new portals can somehow leach the lunar poison out of a man's bloodstream. When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. <coughs> Let's all stay positive and do some science. That said, I would really appreciate it if you could test as fast as possible. Carolyn, please bring me more pain pills. Damn elevator. Now that we have made it up. 
up here. Gonna do this. Here we go. We made it. All right, I've been thinking. When life gives you lemons, don't make lemonade. Make life take the lemons back. Get mad. I don't want your damn lemons. What am I supposed oh to do God. with these? Yeah, take the lemons. Demand to see life's manager. Make life rule the day and thought it could give Kane Johnson lemons. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's gonna burn your house down <laughs> with the lemon. Oh, I'm gonna get my engineers to invent a combustible lemon that burns your house down. Burn his house down. <laughs> Finding people. He says what we're all thinking. Point is, if we can store music on a compact disc, why can't we store a man's intelligence and personality on one? So I have the engineers figuring that out now. Brain mapping, artificial intelligence. We should have been working on it 30 years ago. I will say this, and I'm going to say it on tape so everybody hears it a hundred times a day. If I die before you people can pour me into a computer, I want Carolyn to run this place. <coughs> now she'll argue. She'll say she can't. She's modest like that, but you make her. <coughs> Hell, put her in my computer. I don't care. All right, test's over. <coughs> you can head on back to your desk. Goodbye, sir. Okay, so like this. Dangerous. <laughs> You're not falling over the edge. There we go. Just screw that up there. Why did I just jump into that at the same time? <laughs> Yay, we made it. <laughs> Alrighty, so this is an interesting last chamber. Make it up there. Wow. 
Nope. Miss that. Come on. There we go. God damn it, I missed it again. This is fucking ridiculous. Come on. Ah! Fucking stupid thing. It's freaking ridiculous. There we go. Oh, we just suddenly went through that pipe. <laughs> I don't even know how that happened, but. <laughs> I know how we can beat him.
probably gonna be wrapping this stream up here pretty soon, guys. Um, probably once we get up to this room and whatnot. You know, we've been streaming for about an hour now. Like I said, you know, I am gonna be streaming on Twitch here in about um, like two or three hours. So, you know, if you guys want to, you know, like. If you guys want to tune in for a you know stream over there, you're more than welcome to. Um, I have officially put my Twitch um, link in the you know where the channel art and stuff on my um, the main page. Um, there's a link to the Twitch as well as down in the description below. Um, there is a um, link for my Twitch channel down below. Um, it's right under the us game of duty for official discord um, which if you guys have not joined like yet i highly recommend God's you guys sake, do that um, it's the best legs. way to it's, keep it's track of me you guys can only communicate purpose. with me walking on to what not how can you not do the one thing you're designed for try to get us down there i'll hit him with a paradox like Warmer. i said guys you know i'm gonna be wrapping things up here you know i think this was a good stream you know hope you guys have a good night and you know we and i will pretty much see you guys tomorrow you know i do plan on streaming tomorrow i know i've been streaming like 30 minutes earlier than usual but you know it's all right you know it's gonna be a stream around 3 or 3 30 and the twist stream will always be you know six or seven o'clock eastern standard time so if you guys want to join me on the stream over there i recommend you guys do that but you know until then i'll see you guys tomorrow Bye.